John, it seems like tackling's been kind of a yeah. uh, a big thing to work on this week. Very much so. Uh, we actually tackled live to the ground, which normally you don't do um, on a bye week in the, near the end or middle of your season, but uh, it's just such an issue for us that we felt like that's something that has to be addressed until we become a better tackling defense. Um, we're going to suffer, and we saw the results of that on Saturday. Guys in position, but uh, couldn't couldn't get them on the ground. And when you run the quarterback, you know those are those are issues that uh, your defense has to face. You got you can only have one guy free, and uh, he's got to he's got to deliver. He's got to get him on the ground. So we're working on that. Has it gotten that? progressively worse, or is it just those running quarterbacks exposing it? You know, um, when you look at rushing. Statistics against us, the quarterbacks have been the most successful. Uh, whether it's been scrambling and taking off and escaping the pocket or designed runs where you know he's one on one with one of our defenders and we don't we don't get him on the ground. So that's something that has to be addressed now and, and continue to talk about in the offseason. Along with the tackling, what else did that's you want? That's what I'm saying, what is the tackling? Wanted, yeah, what did else did you want to get out of this week from your guys? Just fundamentals, you know, improving our fundamentals and then obviously developing some of the younger players. When was the last time you had a live practice or a live practice? Live, tackling? live tackling? Yeah. yeah, we just we just drilled it on our own on defense. It was, um, probably, you know, in camp at some point, you know, um, but we need it. Have you ever done it in, in November at a previous time? Uh, yeah, not that I can recall. I'd really have to think hard to, to remember when we did that. But we need it, and that's that's our issue, so let's address it. Obviously, physically, that's going to help them. But does that send a message mentally as well that, look, it's, it's not acceptable. We've got to get that change. That you're yeah, doing. I think it does. And, you know, I, I'll say this. You know, from yesterday till today, the guys did a much better job. You know, they, they uh, were better with their fundamentals in terms of tackling and getting guys on the ground. And, um, you know, we just got to keep getting better. When you talk about repping younger guys this week, it, it, is that in terms of just continuing their, their growth? Or is it because you, you feel like you need to see something for these last two weeks? No, primarily for their growth, you know, and just to continue to evaluate them and see where their progress is. Nothing, no, no depth chart changes or anything in regards to that, Paul. Just, just normal youth development.